On behalf of the Katrara family, I would like to pay a tribute to my uncle. Kathy has always been integral in my life. I was six, year, six months old when Kathy was arrested in 1964. From the time I turned 18, I started visiting Kathy in prison. We discussed the going-ons back home, family, friends, politics, tolerance, and my life. Kathy's embodiment of justice has guided my life. His inherent inclination of doing what is right and showing what is to be kind his sense of discipline and selflessness have been pillars in my life. And for these wholesome qualities, I would like, I, I like many others in the family, would like to thank him for instilling these qualities in us. In relation, in relation to Yasmin and my daughters, Alia and Tasneem, Kathy was a gentle and kind soul. I got married shortly before Kathy's release and his advice to Yasmin was to feed his nephew well and not out of a tin can, a testament to his witty nature. Over the years, we have come to know and to love Kathy for his generosity, his kindness, his sense of justice, his great sense of humor, his quirks, his wisdom, and his purity of soul. My daughters have been deeply inspired by Kathy from a young age by his commitment to politics and his country. But to the, but to the wider Kathrara family, Kathy was more than just a liberation hero and politician. He was a jolly, kind, warm family man. Kathy will be sorely missed for the importance he paid to the youth and his encouragement to the youth to regarding education and furthering their education. His principled approach to life, but most importantly, his sweet nature and heartwarming quips and teasing. The Kathrada family would like to express, the Kathrada family would like to express our gratitude to Kathy for being an example of bravery, courage, strength and discipline. Whilst we lost many years of many years uh, without him, the sacrifices he made for our country have ensured that we can live in dignity and with pride, knowing that the time lost was for a worthy cause. And especially to Barbara, thank you for coming into our family, for sharing Kathy with us. for being his companion and wife. You will always be a special part of our family and our lives. <laughs> Kathy, thank you for fighting every day of our freedom and dignity. Your legacy lives through us all lives through us, all South Africans. Now more than ever, we need to pick up the cudgels and continue with the deep and strong legacy that he has left for us as a family and as a country as a whole. Let us pay tribute to my uncle by committing always to do things what is right, even if it may be hard. It is the secret of the world that all things subsist and do not die but retire a little from sight and afterwards return again. Ralph Emerson. Thank you very much.